What's up? This is Karen Civil, and you are tuned in to Tina Queen TV. Hello. I'm out of breath, and yes, I'm naked. Only because I did 200 sit-ups, and then I did straight through. By the way, shout out to Trainer Joe, and then I also did. 10 burpees. You're probably wondering why. I'll tell you why. I'm in Los Angeles. I didn't even tell y'all that. Yup, your girl's in LA. I have a really fun photo shoot I'm actually about to do. The shoot is actually tomorrow and I leave Wednesday. So my flight here, y'all, was crazy. I actually just kind of landed and the first thing I do want to shower, but I was like, let me get some sit-ups real quick because like, I gotta look good tomorrow. I cannot be looking weak. About to get in the shower, get dressed, get cute, and I'll see y'all. Good morning. It's the next day. It's 7 a.m. here. I'm about to go to Starbucks real quick. Just look at my view. The city is so pretty. Look, you can see the Hollywood sign from here. Let me see if I can zoom in for you. It's so far. November. -ish. November is. Yes, but you can do like BTS, whatever. Period. Do like a vlog, whatever. Can I get you in it? Yes. Hey. Got everybody in it. It's weird. I actually know her. <laughs> it's we from the same. We're from like the same city. I need a shot or something. I'm gonna Relax. Like, I'm You're gonna, in I'm gonna hands. We're gonna take care of you. Water's good, actually. Is there water in the fridge? Yeah. Water. Thank you. Y'all got the good water. I, I'm a little late because I had to do more makeup over again. What happened? Okay. Yeah. That's fine. Do they got got to be spray? Yeah, yeah I, need some, I need some of that. I need some of that. Lay this lace down real quick. How are you? I'm good. How are you? What was that? Giovanna. Hi, I'm Tina. Is it okay if I put this on video? Do you know what? Your camera. I don't know if you, what you usually do. Yo, we in I'm so excited right now. This is the first time we're doing something good like this. Yeah. I'm excited. I just can't wait to see how this turns out. Thank you. This is the product we're using. In my hair. <laughs> We'll get you in on it. This is my shoot for Ethica. Mm -hmm. It's based on Haitian Romeo being beautiful. So this is really dope. This is the first time I've ever done anything like this. Karen actually asked me specifically to spearhead this. I work for Ethica. I work for Creative Strategy. I am the Creative Strategy at Ethica. Period. So this is really dope that um, you know, like we get to do this and Karen trusted me to bring this to life. So even just down to the colors that you see, the cut of the products, it was all made with Haiti in mind. Um, if you see like on the side of the leg, yeah, it says, that. You know, which means you're beautiful and real. I love that. We're really intentional with this collection. We had to get Christina out here for yes. the Haitian women, so I can't wait for you all to see it. Oh, 
Oh, it feels so good out here. Thank you. Okay, so I brought this part. I feel like I'm in school. But <laughs> these are the types of shots we're going to be recreating over there. So these are more so like group shots, women empowerment. Y'all are going to be together. And Karen's in the blue so she can stand out. This is her collection. So I really want to get this one. Like how you're just looking straight on. Like okay. um, and then after that, we're going to try to get some like shots of you guys solo up here but we'll see the time so um So this lit, this shit was alright. It's kind of lit. <laughs> All the women came to the shoot, pit, shoot. Exactly. Had great energy. Mm -hmm. We came prepared. Donye did a good job at that. She did. I tried to do my best at shooting. And make you did a good out. job. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. But y'all did a good job. Y'all look Aww, good in yellow. Thank you. The TikToks was funny. I don't know if y'all really funny, but TikTok is funny. I can dance a little bit, but I don't know. First of all, you sound like a hater. I'm about to delete that the video. Oh, yeah. Alright. <laughs> I made it to LA and the sweet Karen Civil. She got me doing this shoot. I am so happy. I'm so honored. I want to let you know that I am just very honored to do this. Thank you so, Thank you so, so much. much for doing this. I know we've been like talking since last year to try yes. to get this done to me. And in COVID, we made it happen. Amazing group of women. I definitely wanted to include you, following you on social. I'm like, this girl is funny. She is everything of what this collection means and is about. And I just had to show you So we had to get our girl here from Connecticut. Period. To LA. I and love she it killed it. She killed it. She killed it. Like one stop shop. <laughs> It's your first time here? Yeah. So we're at Black House Noho. Let them know. Black owned spot. Best for the brunches on the weekends. You know, Bob was most of it. You can't go wrong with that. But we're here on the motherfucking Tuesday because Donnie just killed the shoe. We just wrapped up at the shoe. Now we are celebrating and um, due for a very long nap. So. Yes. <laughs> I'll sleep at her place. I am not gonna hold you. Oh, we saw we saw the clip. Videos. <laughs> <laughs> so like, I really feel like you know, once Christina and you guys have to hold her to this. Right? Oh, this camera. Wow. Everything. But yes, you guys have to hold her to this. Once she gets back to Connecticut, she has to keep the vibes going. You know, a lot of um, get better. Yes. A lot of people feel like the vibes are in a location. But the location just you makes the vibes. Yes, like the location just ignites the vibe that's already in you. So regardless, like when you go back to Connecticut, mm -hmm. it is your job to remember how you felt during this day and find ways to create it. So you can keep going. You can keep more videos, more, more content. And it's not about perfection. It's about progression. Exactly. You know what I mean? It's the. If we had church on Sunday, if we had church on Sunday, <laughs> preaching. But you cannot go. Another two, three months without posting. Your audience needs you. You need you. Your heart needs you. Your brain needs you. Yeah, I'm back. Leaving. I'm not going nowhere else. Guys, I didn't think y'all actually even cared. Yo, the other day, you'd be surprised. I mean, people. Someone on Twitter was like, Can you make a, a, 
a makeup video and I'm like, who cares? Like, <laughs> like you wanna know what I do? Like, people care. It's like, that's it's starting to feel like nobody cares for a while. an audience too. Like, people are literally waiting for you to like show up. You're right. you're not showing up. I love this part. Oh, yes. 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 No. Yes. Facts. Spin and facts. Okay. The people are waiting for you to show up. All you gotta do is just get there, right? I have to get it. You're the only and person that knows how to be you. Exactly. Can nobody do me better than me? Period. Yes. More videos. More videos. I'm not going anywhere anymore. Can I get it? Yeah, girl. Eat it's one way. It's one way. It's one way. Oh, I you say the right things. You know that, right? Yeah, like you don't do life, life will do you. If you feel stuck, if you feel like you're just doing a lot but you don't see any progress, it's probably because you're just exerting the right energy into the wrong shit. Mm. So like, a lot of, like, you may feel like, yo, like I'm going to work every single day, I'm putting in so much work at my job, but nothing's happening. It's because you're not at the right job. Like. You're putting in mm -hmm. all this energy into something that is not reciprocating it back because that thing mm. is not for you. So it's like, don't let you put in that energy make you feel like, damn, like maybe I should just stop doing this. It's like, no, don't stop until you've literally tried everything. It's kind of like dating. Like sometimes people may feel like, oh, like this person makes me feel like I'm asking for too much, but mm -hmm. it's only like that because the person that you're asking for is too much for them but to somebody else it's not going to be a lot at all it's just you're just in the wrong relationship that's very much a lot true. of people are just in the wrong relationship they're in the wrong friendships they're at the wrong jobs mm -hmm. they're doing the wrong hobbies you know what and I mean? it's, it's a, just yeah it's not they're not passionate you may be doing the right thing but in the wrong situation so sometimes you just got to change that situation but don't change you when I saw the money I was making outside of work, I was like, why am I here? Like, it literally, like I told you earlier, it feels like a hamster wheel. Like, it's like never ending, never ending. And it's the nine to five, Monday to Friday. You mean mm -hmm. to tell me that you got to tell Now you're structuring your life around <laughs> a three-day schedule. Yes, and it's just not, not fair. So, like, a part of me is just like... Why am I punishing myself? Why can't mm -hmm. I just live freely? For once, let me not do something that my what my parents want me to do. Let me like, do something I that feel Christina like I was doing wants all that. Like mm -hmm. growing up, like if it was up to me, I think college is for everybody. But I probably wouldn't have gone. Yeah, especially because like if I it was love, free, I would I go. love yellow facts. Right, UConn <laughs> is an amazing school, and I'm grateful. Most people don't get the opportunity to go. I get it, but it was just like. Girl, you knew nothing. Your major, your true passion was not at that school. Like, at least go to a school where I know it was for me. Right. And that's where, like, that's what happens when you listen to people and you follow other people's rules. Like, live by your own rules and you see how happy you end up. Like, mm -hmm. it's crazy. Like, when you mm -hmm. really stop caring about what people think, mm -hmm. life is just amazing. Mm -hmm. So I think I'm in the next progress of life where it's kind of like, all right, figuring things out. Yeah, and you know, so it's. It's not it's figuring out what's next and like and there's no finish line so and you I, could I made a plan out. in my head too so it's like I'm now just going along order like I'm pushing out content 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 because I realized the more content the more money the mm -hmm. more exposure mm -hmm. Wait, I and I feel like you genuinely like it I you know love I mean? it but I don't know why I couldn't find myself to do anything else and I think that was depression like I it, like TikTok like low key I would avoid the app I didn't want to look at it. I was under pressure mm -hmm. like I gotta keep up with this stuff I gotta make more and there's times when I didn't feel like making more so then I found found a rhythm where it was like okay record a bunch leaving your drafts and post like, yeah yeah all i gotta do yeah. and that's I'm a tip for everybody out there who's looking to um actually you know get on tiktok like that's really how you would balance your your time <laughs> it was so nice meeting you nice let me know oh when you God, come fun. back i didn't even LA. think i would come out come back and hang out with you and get food meet some more yeah, people like that I was fun that right. was fun. I'm happy I we did that. Because if I just went home, I would have just been in my room all night. And even on your phone scrolling. <laughs> exactly. Which you do on the plane. This you know is what I mean? fun. Yes. So, girl, gonna talk to you. We gonna be in touch. Yeah, that was super bright early tomorrow. Yes. I'm gonna go yes. in my hotel, guys. I'm gonna talk to you when I get to my room. Yes. Good morning. Mm -mm. Holding notes, period. So, listen, y'all. It's time for me to wrap it up. I gotta go and I don't wanna go. I gotta say goodbye to all of this. I don't want to. Anyways, last night was so dope, y'all. It's like, 
my horoscope, I know, like, I don't really, like, pay attention to it, but I do. It said I'll be meeting people that are very like-minded this weekend. And I'm a Sagittarius, for those who don't know. And they said within 72 hours, my life will change. It's Wednesday. It was 72 hours since I read it. I met people who I'm like, wow. Like, y'all would deadass be my friends if I lived here. And they are my friends now. I made new friends. I'm so happy. There is just like me, Danye. Shout out to you. She was the correct director of the Ethica shoot. Just so, like, beautiful. She had wise words the whole night. And she just, they just encouraged me. Um, Chris was really dope. Um, Izzy was dope, too. It was just really an experience. And I felt like I met my lane. I met the people who I should be around more often because they pushed me. They put that battery in my back, and I really love that. Although I know I should be putting that battery in my back. But it feels different and nice for someone else for a change to tell you. I'm packing right now. I only got like 20 minutes to pack. I got to go. But last night was incredible. I had the best fun. The shoot was amazing. It was just like... Just great energy Karen was so sweet y'all this is a trip I'm gonna remember for the rest of my life like I met so many dope people made so many connections I just feel like this is not the end there will be more so right now I'm about to get packed up and everything and um honestly don't feel like taking my camera to the airport so i'm gonna wrap it up right here i want to thank y'all for watching please like subscribe and comment on this video i know it's been a minute since i post but i will be back and i'm gonna be better just trust me this trip just it just did that for me thank you so much for watching tina queen tv y'all are the best and i will see y'all next time